We all know by now that Marvel's Thunderbolts is officially in development. It's been confirmed by multiple people working on it. But one question still lingers, and that is, what are they going to do with Thunderbolt Ross? You know, the character that the team is named after. So one thing that many of you have asked me to talk about is my thoughts on the whole Thunderbolt Ross situation and what do they do with Thunderbolt Ross considering that the actor who plays him has passed away. Now previously I made a video about this, but this is going to take a different approach to it. And this is the recast route. Many people have said that Marvel Studios should do what they are doing with Chadwick Boseman's Black Panther and say that the character died off screen and have somebody pick up the spirit of what he was doing more than likely Valentina and that she is going to put together this team that was his idea and call it the Thunderbolts in his name. Now again, that's great, but I think we're starting to run into some problems here. If we just start automatically taking characters off the board or out of films and saying that they died off screen or got killed off off screen, to me personally, that seems kind of pointless and almost the laziest approach to it. Like, let's be real. I talked about this with E-Man in a very extensive podcast and interview that I did with him in regards to Black Panther and the recasting. A lot of people listened to that and loved his take on why Black Panther should be recast. I will have that pop up so you guys can listen to that entire thing. And he convinced me and multiple other people that they should recast. Specifically because there is actors out there who can carry on the spirit, pay respect to the actor, and also land a job that is career making and have tons of people look up to that character who are fans of that character. Now, again, I'm not saying that Thunderbolt Ross is on the level of Black Panther, but you can apply that same argument here. Saying that the character just got killed off screen or died off screen limits you to the same thing and the new expectation where now anytime an actor might pass away or something happens, suddenly we're just going to accept that, oh, well, they're just going to be written off screen. I mean, do we take that approach or would they have taken that approach with any other characters? To me, this seems like backwards thinking. Again, we've seen recasting happen throughout the history of Hollywood. I mean, go back to like the Harry Potters. I don't know why that's on my mind. I don't like the Harry Potter franchise, but that happened, you know, and it worked out for them. Again, you can't just be limited by going, well, the actor passed away, so we need to just abandon the character. I don't think that's the correct way to do it. Instead, honor the actor, honor the character, and carry on that spirit. I think there's plenty of actors who would love to take on the job of what Thunderbolt Ross was going to do for the Thunderbolts and the future of the MCU, and also pay respect to him, but make it their own. And you can even put a tribute to the character when the film comes out. And I think that's more powerful than just saying, well, the character, he's gone off screen. I know that this is just my opinion, but to me, this honestly feels like the right way to go. Recasting and carrying on the spirit is what they should do.